Well, the uh, first question is probably related to, to Nick. Nick practiced yesterday and uh, looked good, so uh, he's good to go in terms of the game tomorrow. Okay, Mary Catherine's got the microphone. We'll go ahead and get questions for you guys. Raise your hands. Go ahead and get it to Tyler. You mentioned, uh, I think, last week or maybe two weeks ago about the Nike ball, how you guys thought it was slippery. Did that have anything to do with the way you guys shot at Alabama? Or, yeah, you know I think what? we pulled up some stats, and then there's actually a correlation that you guys are shooting worse with that Nike ball. Yeah, I don't know that. I, I certainly don't want our players to think that. It's still round. Uh, you know, it's different. We practice with them. Uh, and uh, when I, I think about... Uh, some of our games. Um, I think we practiced, played with a Nike ball at, at uh, Vanderbilt. Uh, we won there. I don't know if we shot that great. I can't remember. Uh, but in any event, uh, yeah, I don't think it's, I mean, you know, it is what it is. You know, it's a lot different, uh, you know, when you're having to play in uh, different weather if you're a football player than, uh, you know, the ball being the thing, but uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, playing Ole Miss for the second time, this is the first time, first, second time opponent that you guys have had. Just uh, how has the game plan changed from that first game and how much does Henson factor into that game plan now? Yeah, Henson had a great game against us and uh, obviously 26 points and <clears throat> he was effective shooting the ball from three and uh, you know, obviously we've got to be very aware of him and you know, they have an outstanding team and you know, led by, you know, Davis and Tyree, uh, you know, those two guys uh, in particular, you know, have been incredibly consistent both in the non-conference and the conference in terms of their <coughs> scoring and, and uh, you know, for you know, all the different things they do defensively, rebounding. I mean, I think Davis is averaging eight rebounds a game, which is, you know, very impressive. Shooting a great percentage, doing, passing the ball well, you know, Tyree's makes big shots and, you know, gets a lot of assists. Uh, but, you know, uh, all in that, you know, he, the big kid, he, he really played well uh, against us. I think he's really one of the most improved players in the league when you look at, uh, you know, where he was uh, his first two years to where he is now. And, you know, Stevens played well. He had two big threes against us and, uh, you know, had a controversial play in the last minute that uh, didn't, uh, didn't go against uh, them, uh, but uh, you know he, he he's playing well as a senior and uh, doing a good job for him and, and playing a very important uh, role for their team. And you know I like Schubert. I mean they got nice pieces, so it's a good team. And we've got to do a better job with them uh, in every respect. Go ahead, Brett. Then if not the the Nike ball, do you attribute struggling shooting on the road recently to all the other usual things? as to why teams usually struggle shooting on the road, backdrop, things like that? Yeah, you know, I, I don't know that. Uh, I think that uh, on the road, you know, uh, you, sh you know, you're playing a team on their home floor, you've got to even be more uh, efficient offensively in terms of execution to get good shots and take good shots. And we missed some open shots in our last game, but uh, you know, we also took some, some tough shots too. And, it's about, you know, everything about shooting has to do with the quality of the shot, uh, you know, in my mind, quality of the shot. And, uh, you know, I've seen us shoot really well with the Nike ball in practice, so, you know, I know that we're capable. This will be the... Keep, everybody stay a little, a little lower voice here. we got a baby in the room. <laughs> Uh, it takes a lot to rattle you, so you gotta okay. go to the you want to. That's pretty good, though. Mm -hmm. Cute, very cute. Mm -hmm. uh, this will be the third weekend in a row where if you win on Saturday, you'll have gotten back to 500. Is it mentally taxing on a team to, you know, we have to win to get back to 500, then it's back to 500, then it's back to 500 again, instead of being able to stack wins up? Hey, it's the SEC for us right now, and we've got to, you know, there's a lot of reasons why we need to win this game, but no, no question, we need, we, we, need, we need this one desperately. And it's going to be uh, two teams fighting very hard to get the win tomorrow. Let's go ahead and get it to Joel. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. 
I wanted to ask you about, uh, I kind of asked you the other night after the game about y'all practicing with the uh, the Nike ball. Did y'all ask that already? Yeah. 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 Okay. Well, then I'll go back and ask them, then that way you don't have to answer the same question twice out of that. Well, what was your question? Well, just, just in your career, uh, with the disparity in the numbers of how well y'all shot the Wilson ball and, ha and haven't shot the Nike ball as well, is that something you've seen throughout your career? Just No, no. In fact, you know, we always, the balls are a little bit different, but... Uh, you know, at the end of the day, you know, I would credit our, our opponent's defense more than I would the ball. Yeah. And and really, you know, our I think I mentioned right before you came in is we just got to take better quality shots in some cases. With the success that Alabama had inside, what did you see when you went back and watched the film? What were the lapses? Yeah, you know, the lapses were we did a very <coughs> poor job keeping them out of the paint off the dribble. You know, just did a very poor job of helping one another. You know, their whole game plan was to go downhill at us and try to drive us, drive us, drive us, and we weren't doing enough step helping. We didn't do a good enough job aggressively pressuring the ball, so instead of the, the drive going uh, towards the basket, it had to go lateral first. So, you know, we've got to do a better job. Anything else for Coach before we let him go? All right. Thank, Thank you, guys. You.